He's not ready to do nine to five. When he says nine to five, he's not ready to come here and work. He's a boss. Right. That's what he's saying. Okay. Huh. Okay. He's a boss. <laughs> so he's, he's 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 running things in Nigeria, but he's willing to you know to come in. Hey guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Hope you guys are well. My yes, name is April. And my name is Akoni. In today's video, we're going to be answering a question that was sent to us. Um, and this man says, my wife's job is moving her to the UK. Mm. So my kids and I are coming as dependents. Mm. I don't plan on working nine to five so I can take care of our three kids. Mm. But I also have a business in Lagos that I can run from anywhere. Mm -hmm. My question is, will I be able to secure credit facilities, personal loans, and what are the tax implications for me? that <laughs> <laughs> business person like me like me I, I don't think I have much to say when it comes to like running a business or giving you advice on businesses or anything my my own thing is the real life stuff mm -hmm. you know when it comes to finances or you know education or stuff like that I'm sorry I might not be able to help but when it comes to real life advice or what I've been through then I might, I might be able to help you so she's the she's the guru remember so <laughs> so let her give you the advice so I'll say um, yeah I mean it's a fantastic thing that you're doing mm. um, saying you're gonna be taking care of the kids at home yeah. I mean thumbs up to you for that um, running your business from anywhere in the world there's like the best thing that can happen to anyone mm -hmm. and now the internet has made it very easy yes. you know you can speak to your team via zoom you're not worried about anyone um mishandling your phones etc i mean you can still manage people mm. virtually which mm. is fantastic when it comes to the money side of things in the uk i'm sure you're presently paying taxes in lagos mm -hmm. running your business are you ready to start are paying you, are you paying tax in lagos <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure he is. I'm sure okay, he is. Let's, 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 let's assume this. that you are. Because most, you... most people don't talk. And of course. Be, uh, we, we all be the same people complaining that, oh, Nigeria is not moving forward. Do you pay your tax? I'm sure he does, okay. actually. <laughs> We're assuming that you do. So are you ready to start another arm of your business in the UK? Mm -hmm. Like you legally register your business it doesn't it doesn't it doesn't work it does. yeah if you want to run your business in the uk to act, access to loans but that wasn't the question he yeah. said he's ready to be a full-time dad looking after the kids yeah he's not ready to work here nine to five yes so i think his plan is running his but business he wants to home. have yeah but he wants to have loans and credit facilities yeah he just he wants loan he wants money but he's not ready to work nine to five yeah but you can register your business mm. start running the business in the uk he does not want to run any business that's uh, if you want to look at questions <laughs> <laughs> no. but he wants to have access to loans in yeah, the that's uk that's why you will tell him that you cannot have access to loans if if you if you if you don't have a job basically no but if you if your business is registered you can have access to loans but once your business is registered yearly the government will be expecting you to do the needful yeah so that's what i'm saying yeah, like it's already too. It's already we, de too. we don't know yeah, we no, don't, don't 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 follow the question okay just follow the question okay okay follow the question don't let us don't assume for him to support but, to support with and can listen okay, to me okay 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 shakote no 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 uh -huh. Just follow okay. the question. Follow the qu don't as no assumption. No assumption. No assumption. He said he's willing to come. That's why he's saying you just need to advise him. Let him know if he if he if he's going to be able to have access to funds or not. Yeah. That's all. Okay. I think you'll be able to have access to funds if your business is registered in the UK and you're working and you're working, but. Your wife can also have access to credit cards and loans because she's the one working and she can apply for the loans by her own name and add you as a beneficiary. So that's my well, answer. Would, okay, let me put it this way. Even though I don't I don't know the the mathematical stuff when it comes to you know finances and everything, mm. but you know, I've, I've I've run through a lot of credit cards myself and a couple of loans myself. What I know is I might be wrong. If I'm wrong, 
please go to the comment section and you know advise them as well. Yeah. But based on my Apollo Badan, you know, I want to the a in a way. Well, my mind. So let me give you my own advice. What I what I believe is, if your wife is going to school and she's working, yeah. Because for you to apply for a loan, they they're going to ask you, okay, are you working? How much are you making? Right. Are you, are you employed? Full full time? Em, are you in full time employment or you're self employed? So they're going to use the amount that you're making yearly or monthly. That's what they will use to calculate the money that they're going to give to you. Mm. So you're not just going to come because you have a work permit or resident permit that you just go to a bank. They will give you money. No, it doesn't work like that. In fact, you have to even build your credit ratings. Right. So, what can happen in your own case, based on your question, is that if your wife is she's going to school and she's working, you know, mind you, she'll be doing 20 hours and 40 hours when school is in session. Yeah. So, the kind of money that she will have access to might not be a lot. Mm. And it should take some time for her to build her credit ratings to the level whereby you might be able to get that kind of money that I think that you are talking about, mm. sir. So, so what she can do is since you're not you're you know you're willing to stay with the kids, mm. look after the kids, so you're not you're not ready to work under anybody. That's why you know, because you're not ready to do nine to five, you have a good business back home. Yeah. The thing that the only thing that can happen is when she applies for she can apply for a loan. Okay? Yeah. She can only apply for a loan in her name. Yeah. So whether it's up to her to give the money to you or already no. And she can also also apply for a credit card. But mm-hmm. some credit uh, credit companies, you know, kind of allow you to put your partner on the card, mm. which means if they give your if they give your wife like let's say a thousand pounds on the credit card, yeah, you know, they can add you to the to the account, yeah. But you still have access to the same amount, a thousand pounds, yeah. So whether she's willing to share that with you, but I might be wrong. Please mm-hmm. correct me if I'm wrong. I don't know everything. Is if you don't have like she said, if you don't have. A, if you're not running a business, you're not self-employed, mm. or a manager, a director, or mm. you're not working nine to five, or you're working for someone mm. that is traceable. Like I said, there's a system here. Yes, yeah. You know what I said earlier about people not paying tax in Nigeria. Jokingly, is the truth. Yeah. There's a system in the yeah. UK. There's a system. So everything is traceable. Everything is traceable. There's a system. You can't. You can't. You can't cheat the government. And if yeah. you, even if you do, when they catch you, my, my, my brother, my sister, you'll be sorry for yourself. Yeah. And there's no ignorance in um, in law or whatever they say. Like mm-hmm. you can't say I don't know. Yeah. Because information is like everything is there online. That's you can, true. You can always Google stuff up. There's yeah. no there's no excuses anywhere. So for you to have access to your like a loan in your name, or a credit card in your name, you have to have a job. Yes. Whether you're your own boss mm-hmm. or you're working for someone. Yeah. So that's what I would say based on my own, you know, my own knowledge. So. Um, yeah, since you're coming to be looking after the kids and all that, you know, your wife might be able to apply for, she might be able to apply for a credit card and put you on the credit card. Yeah. So you have access to the same amount. It's not that she you she will have one, access to £1,000 and you will have access to £1,000, making £2,000. Mm. No. If the, if, if, if the limit on the card is £4,000, yeah, then you, you will be able to, you know, use the same amount. But everything will be in her name. So if you take the money and you don't pay back, they start chasing her. Yeah. Possibly you as well, but she's the main Applicants. person. So for you to have access to loans and credit cards and, you know, if you're not, you have to have a job. And if you don't want to have a job, mm. you can register your business yeah. in the UK yeah. and make it, you know, run your business in the UK virtually yeah. and still have access to like PayPal loans, your mm. bank loans, etc. Yeah. But you you have to be willing to pay taxes at yeah. the end of the year. Yeah, you, have, you have to be willing because once you register a company at the end of the year, yeah, you, do, do, you, you have to submit something. Oh, the letter. Yeah, sure, okay. I'll get a fellow, a fellow open company of a letter by image. Check your animal closer. See, it's even not invention. No, they don't joke with anything. Once you register a company at the end of the year, they expect you to do the needful. That's true. My brother, back to your question. You like for you to even say you're going to be, you know, a stay at home dad. Kudos to you. God bless you. Your business will continue to grow, but you might not be able to physically have access to loan. Yes. But your wife will definitely be able to, you know, apply for loans or credit cards based on. How much she's making or yes. what she's making yeah let me put it that way what yeah. she's making so um you can, yeah you can have one or two things to it yeah i think i've i've said everything that i wanted to say mm. um 
if you want to have access to loans or mm. you even want to grow your business yeah. internationally yeah. you have to be willing to sacrifice the tax implications yeah. whenever you start the business but mm. don't limit yourself you mm. never know you can have an arm in lagos you mm. can have an arm in the uk yeah. usa you never know mm -hmm. so i'll say do it yeah. yeah i have <laughs> me i love to take risk yeah. i'll say do it yeah. and um and see how it goes yeah. if, there are, if there are ways that you can register a company here and maybe maybe you'll be sending stuff home yeah exactly you that's know, another thing stuff home to sell since you're a business person yeah maybe you'll be traveling to because you have a you, you know you have a work you know you, you have a work permit and you can as well just travel maybe i don't know the kind of business that you're doing mm. like, you know for you to run a good business and you know be comfortable to say oh you know, I'm coming to be a stay-at-home dad. Yeah. You, you're doing well already. So, yeah. um, like she said, if you want to have access to loan, loans or credit cards, then you have to register a company here and trade, basically. Yeah. Do something. Yeah. You know, be able to say, okay, this is what I'm making in a year. Then, of course, the loan is there. But at the same time, this mm -hmm. is what we think. No, let us know in this comment section if you got any advice for them. I, I mean, we don't, we don't know it all. So, if you have one or two you know advice for them or advices for them yeah so just put it in the comment section i'm sure they'll be reading the comments and they'll be able to make up their mind yeah you know but you'll be fine but that loan aspect yeah you just follow what we've said and you know read comments as well yeah. so that you can make up your mind yeah so our camera battery died so we just have to quickly switch to this so yeah we're just gonna round up now so um yeah we hope you found today's video helpful um as usual please leave in the comments your advice and suggestions you have for this family and we look forward to seeing you guys on the next video until next time please take care and bye guys